Hello guys, it's Mungai Eve. Welcome to the Mungai Eve show and of course we're the number one online TV show. Na leo nimepatana na msani mmoja wa gospel. Unasema anga sijui nini gospel leo niko na mwenyewe sasa. Uko aje? Niko poa niko poa WhatsApp WhatsApp is a boy much more na pause. Jibo wa wa jibo one way the only way is Jesus Christ so sio. Tuko ndani. Eh ndani ya Mungai Eve. Mungai Eve umetusumbua Instagram wapi? Instagram hapana. Anasema eh uko by the tumeona job yako sana. Mimi ni mse napenda kuangalia social media. Tumeona job yako from the first job ili ku make you hit. Na yote ni favor ya God najua. Yeah. Kweli ni favor ya God. Ah uh, Mwash uh, ningependa utuambie like uh, unajua kumekuwa na propaganda mob sana about gospel but wewe ni msanii ambaye ameshikilia gospel since day one. What is it that ina keeping you going like wewe bado unaendelea? Eh mimi 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 God amenitoa ghetto mkuru kwa Sinai. Place ni kwa nalala kwa nyumba ya Mpesa. Place ni kwa nakula na kunguni. Nimelala kwa kwa gari wa Ania. God I mean to up us wezi muacha like I can never change na ministry yangu ni ku give hope and I always give hope to everyone but cause ni God I mean I mean call ministry yangu stay wacha so gospel little by gospel the bible says every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess so hakuna siku yenye gospel itaenda chini cause gospel ni God wewe sema gospel iko chini cause gospel ni nini gospel ni Christ so wewe sema Christ ako chini so gospel iko ni wale wa God ameka hapo maybe wame fail tumo fail but bado gospel iko yeah okay uh, unajua kuna kuanga na hizo stories mob sana like how do you take it uh, as a gospel artist <laughs> eh siwa natutukana sana pale instagram kwa mimi mtandao ya kijamii but at the end of the day kama wewe ni uko god amekuweka place fulani wewe ziona mtu anagonga mti haina matunda mawe so uki okay, god akikuweka pale juu watu watakaa wakutukane wakwambie oh una do vitu fulani kwa life but at the end of the day wewe kuna wasa una impact mtaani ghetto mkuru kayande kila place ghetto zote una, una empower una like una inspire wase so kama una inspire wase kuna wale wase kazi yao ni ku kuku kukufinyilia wende chini na hiyo platform wana get kwa social media so ni poki wana sana kuchukia wengi jua watu wana kupenda yeah okay ah mash we ni msani ambaye ni mekua ni kiono ki support sana wasa ni wengine there was a time ah bahati ya litua album album wenye ulifanya poa sana ah like ah why do you always like wewe ni mtu mwenye you keep ah unakuangana ukaribu sana na bahati what is your relationship with bahati Hey, but my G to me Joanna for long kutoka I mean inspire nikiwa nikiwa naishi kwa nyumba ya Mpesa nilikuwa na picha ya bahati ya gazeti kukuta so time to limit na bahati tuka click bahati is a very close friend of mine kando na mziki mindo ni memfanya nyumba yake ile nyumba mnaona ya bahati ya kondani mindo ni medizaini ya Diana Marwa sindo tumetengeneza kila kitu ya tumetengeneza ya pia wase wengi cause me pia nafanya construction ama interior designer ya very good architecture ya 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 we tunathang god ama street smart actually ya mtu kama bahati ni mse ni mekua na hii akiwa down social media akiwa poor but real life akiwa down nimemuona nimemuona akiwa strong ni msa men inspire to family issues to celebrity issues mimi nimeona eh, bahati akifunga town mzima i move sabia bahati one day so mimi na, najua bahati very close kwa se kwa industry ukiuliza mashimoa na mimi ni msen very close na wasi wengi so like anywhere ukienda ulize unajua mashimoa na tutambua ya tunamjua sabu ya mimi ni msem positive sana na life. Okay. And what is your take about his album? Kwa sababu ni leo na pia wewe you took a very major part on it. Ulikuwa pale kuwakilisha vizuri kabisa. Yeah, yeah, but is um, of course uh, I cannot talk about his spirituality or anything sure. but uh, in terms of work he's really good. Like he's very smart, he's very aggressive like anajituma kia mwa kufanya kitu afanye nusu nusu. So like ana inspire wa say any either gospel or secular that anything you want you can get it like mm -hmm. you can just push no way mm -hmm. yeah. okay ah uh, wewe mash kama msanii ambaye unafanya gospel na bahati anafanya anafanya zote zote <laughs> ya yeah, unajua kuna ngazi zile mbaya zote 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 ni nzuri ah uh, ningependa at least you let us know unajua wa Kenya sana sana most of the time huwa tuna judge sana unapata tunasema eh hey, huyu alienda upande mwingine so unapata mtu kama bahati willy paul ni wasanii ambao wanapigwa mawe sana 
watu wanasema one of the root of kuanguka kwa gospel what do you have to say about that eh hakuna nimesema na ndarudia tena gospel ijaanguka mm. unajua kuna kuna mwenye nyumba na kuna wajenzi kuna wale wasana jenga nyumba na kuna mwenye nyumba so wale watu wanajenga nyumba ndo walianguka si mwenye nyumba so gospel liko hapo so, god alikuwa ametutuma sisi tufanye gospel wengine wale bado gospel liko kuna wasana kuna watu wajui story isiolo unanipata kuna watu wajui wana tv sio wana sikiza radio bado wanasikiza muziki zetu bado wako inspired mimi my first song uh, yenye nilitweka in media in 2016 from Sinai ili ni new artist of the year groove awards in 2016 i was the new artist of the year groove awards so gospel yenye bado sai akina Willy Paul and our our say ni, ni few among us say 1 million 20 million no get kuna wase, kuna generation mpya god ana raise ya gospel yenye wase wana what am worship in truth and spirit no matter what the design they are wearing no matter the situation wako in unanipata so watu wengi unajua sasa hivi wana judge gospel na looks wana judge gospel na trends mm-hmm. but gospel ni gospel if unaweza sikiza ngoma ya msei ku touch that is gospel mm-hmm. kama inaweza change life yako that's gospel mm-hmm. yeah oh, the pia uh, masterpiece ni msanii wa gospel yeah. na ametoa EP yake juzi pia ndilo ndio ulikuwa pale kumpiga yeah. support relationship yako na masterpiece ni gani uh, masterpiece uh, we, we are the, we, like masterpiece mimi na masterpiece we call each other family mama yake ni, ni mama yangu like sisi ni family apart from music masterpiece is my family mm-hmm. so masterpiece ni msemi meona from class akimaliza form 4 ndio nilikuwa nashinda new artist of the groove arts new, new artist of the year so mimi wakati nilishinda nilikuwa na a lot of interviews uh, so hiyo ndio time ali come back na nikamshika mkono nikamrudisha kwa interviews kwa shows shows ni kwa naitiwa groove arts safaricom nilikuwa naenda na yeye na perform na muita kwa stage anajiri introduce tena. So masterpiece tumekaa the same place. Mimi na masterpiece tumefungiwa nyumba the same. Tu, yani tumekuwa through a lot na masterpiece are very like hata before atoe wimbo. Like lazima ni one of the guys mwenye who approve hii song lazima itoke ama istoke. Ah uh, wacha ni kupati exclusive moja wasi wengi wajui. Chini ya mwamba it was the song that ilirudisha masterpiece kwa game. Okay. That song masterpiece ali shoot na rent. Mm-hmm. ya nyumba tukafungiwa mm-hmm. aka shoot song unanipata tuko na lala nje sababu ya song ya masterpiece but that song ili change life ya masterpiece so mm-hmm. but right now that is um, three years ago masterpiece is driving a mercedes benz the same guy ndio ilikuwa pia tunalala tukifungua nyumba ndasema pia mimi i'm driving mercedes but see, see, we are not bragging we are just showing people that there is process to everything like Okay, okay, keep on trusting in God. Kuna vitu zingine atakufungulia supernatural. Cuz always niambia wewe unajua ku interview kuliko any mtu mwingine. Easy vision kubwa kuliko kila mtu, but God amekupatia e time ya kushine. So like it's all about time ya God. Like iko and time yako cuz your first interview iko work town. Na ni get. Haikuwa kwa TV kubwa, ilikuwa place so God ana coming place yenye wewe uko. Uenda ki place God ako God come place wewe uko. So mimi nasema God I'll to meet Ali come place it uko. Unanipata akatumit akatuambia niaje. That's why masterpiece let me tell you masterpiece watu wengi wanamuona kama secular artist sabi ya looks. But ndakwambia kuna watu wengi upiga simu wanambia masterpiece that song ime change life yangu. Si lazima aseme kwa media. So mimi naambia ukweli gospel tabaki kwa gospel. Haitawa yeah. change. Now is it that wa Kenya wana judge um, sani kama masterpiece by looks? <laughs> ni sababu yeah. unajua wa Kenya tuko na shida moja. Ke, wa Kenya tuko na shida ya kupenda kitu hatujui. But ile kitu tunajua ndio hii yetu hatui support. Like right now you'll see ndakwambia media house utaona sababu kuna msanii mkubwa wa complete. Wataacha ule msanii yeye support daily. Waende ule msanii wa one day. Na akirudi anakuja kuambia, "Hey, can I have interview with you?" But last week anakumbuka alikupita kimbili ya msanii mkubwa. So we make, we, we make our own. Then our our set tuna make ndo atawa make cuz kama ukikuwa na msanii ama ukikuwa na mtu wa kuinterview ukekuwa umen get so lazima kuwe msee ndio mtu mwingine akuwe so wase watakujudge no matter udu nini hata leo hata Yesu alikuwa mwana wa Mungu na walimjudge wakamsulubisha so wewe ni nani so ukijajiwa juu uko poa yani ukipigwa mawe jo you in the right place okay yeah. and what is your take about the ep hiyo ya masterpiece yenye ametoa eh hey, iko na ngoma noma sana iko na love song ndani mm-hmm. na god ni love but kitu naweza ambia wasa wa gospel 
wajue whatever you una, una, una give us say like ina mean a lot sana kwa wase unaona mimi nakwambia ukweli mimi na wasanii wakubwa wa secular ni kuonesha wakubwa big wana ndiye mimi wakiniambia ngoma yako imeni bless men get like wabigi wana wanaimba secular kabisa but mimi wananikola wanambia mash na ni bless na song zako baka wase wanaimba secular wana to check men get well. no matter what no matter song zetu maybe as 10 million but songs that is an impact mtu watano wakisikiza zina change life zao mm-hmm. yeah. and that's your main goal my main goal is to change life zao says not money money comes follow first the kingdom of god and his righteousness those it will come na kwambia ukiwakia god mtu atakupatia gari free mtu atakupea nyumba free because unawakia the mighty god mwenye ame create huo mse unanget so ukiwa na hiyo trust na, na believe in god uta make it uh-huh. okay tukimalizia mash Uh, kuna story inaendelea anga kwa mtandao ambao tujui kama ni ya ukweli ama ni ya uongo. Watu wanasema anga mwashwana ni msia ambaye ana hela kweli. Wengine wanasema ni za washwash. Ningependa utuambie. Washwash ni nini? <laughs> Sijui. Yeye anyway, mimi ndo ambie hivi kweli. Watu wana judge kulingana na venyewe wanafeel. Mimi labda mimi mi napita shida zingine kama mtu wa kawaida but ile kidogo napata tosheka nayo na niget mimi hata bila one, nikiwa hata bila shilingi utajua unanipa hata cause nimetosheka na ile kitu god amenipatia so just work hard mimi mara mob kesho niko na interview but nimelala kwa mjengo people don't know that men get people don't know that but wanaangalia results za kupata do hakuna mtu anajua ni sailala kwa gari hakuna mtu anajua ni kwa nalala kwa mtaro but right now sabu zilali hapo wana judge men get so hizo ni vitu za, za media na vitu za social media so hizo ni vitu zinapita tu sio za ukweli ah mimi sijui hizo ni vitu gani uh, so maybe unaweza tuelezea apart from uh, unajua watu wengi wakisikia msanii uko na do na anafanya muziki wanashangai do inatoka kwa muziki peke yake ama pia ni kwa hiyo kazi nyingine ambayo umetuambia unafanya uh, interior designing mimi uh, hata kama nafanya interior designing iko na do but pia music iko na do si lazima ni tuwe show kubwa yenye iko kwa stadium ndo nilipwe mimi remember nimeitoa mashow mo private eh? Addison is gonna watu prominent kama akina akina former akina Sonko unaitwa private mtu anakuambia ngoma yako ina ni bless how much unalipisha unaambia unalipa much anakuambia i'll give you 300k na ni msee ajulikani but hako na do ya ku bless watu na do so mimi ambia wase wacha kuangalia kitu watu wako nayo you just walk on your way God atakupata hapo atakupatia do either kuwe mkubwa ama usikuwe mkubwa una get mimi nime get do, do mob sana za show mob nimeenda private shows church place zingine wase tu hata kuna wase wa 10 wanakujua but huo mse mwenye ako na dondo anakujua na ana bless na hiyo do yeah. okay mwash tukimalizia ningependa uambie wasanii upcoming kitu especially wenye wanafanya gospel kwa sababu kwa hii generation yetu uh, inaonekana anga ni kama kufanya gospel ni dhambi ningependa uongeleshe <laughs> Yo manzo acha niambie wase wana come. Ku serve God si shamba, unaweza serve God na vai chains kama mimi, serve God na utoboe masikio kama mimi, una serve God na uchore tattoo, una serve God cause God anasema come venye uko. So, unaweza serve God the way you are. So, manze kama unataka ku serve God usidanganywe na mtu. Secular na gospel, muziki ni muziki, struggle ni same. So kama umeokoka usidanganywe na mtu atukienda secular utapata doa ama utahit. Utahit na utakuwa na do. God ndo anapea na do. God ndo anapea na wealth. God ndo anapea na hit songs. So focus first na God. Na kitu yote una do. Na pia hata siku yetu tunakuamilia kufanya muziki na hakuna kitu kingine na support music. Jaribu ku work. Biblia inasema mtu anafanyi kazi ya skule. So kama ufanyi kazi hauna do ya ku support music utabaki hapo forever. So work hard do your music invest on your music na god atakusaidia sawa sawa mwash tuambie social media handles zako na pia pale watu wanaweza pata ngoma zako ndio waendelee kubarikiwa yo kwa instagram nipate at mashmona mapose kila mali at mashmona mapose and please subscribe to my youtube channel Eve Mungai Mungai Eve the Kabisa. biggest show the biggest online show follow manze to share push the mu- a, the industry push the online uh, media to the international platforms manzenda pia wewe kama upcoming wewe kama msanii umes, umesha hit pia usaidike yeah. okay guys uh, it has been the mungai if show tumekuwa na mwashmwana muendelee kusubscribe kwa channel yangu we meet next time